what perhaps did you do before you were teaching? Like, what other things have you done? I mean, like Philip Levine lives there or something? I mean, mm -hmm. yeah. For about 20 years before I taught, I designed automotive dyes. Right. And an automotive die is this big metal object that stamps out parts, in my case, car parts. So I did that for the better part of 20 years. Did that influence your writing? And then um, also attached to that, what other poets influenced you? I know that's a terrible question. I think it influenced my writing. Um, I liked doing it, and it was a lot like writing in that you began with nothing and you had to create this thing. There were rules, there were, were limitations, but within those there was a tremendous amount of freedom. And I find writing to be that way um, also. Um, as far as who influenced me, I hate that question because I, I wrote for years without reading, without knowing about poetry, and it's only later that I started reading people. Um, like right now I'm reading a poet named Mary Rufel, and I enjoy her work very much. Yeah. But there was never anyone who kind of got in my body and who I was trying to model myself after. Mm -hmm. uh, other writers now, for me, they tend to make me feel small in a wonderful way. I like having these people around who, who their work, I look at it and I think I could never do that. And it makes me want to try harder. Mm 